Hi, my name is Natasha from Natasha Castellan Art and I'm here in the artist chat room. Now I started the artist chat room because I felt there was a need to talk about the business side of art. There's a lot out there about how to create art, workshops that you can do online, in person, lots of content out there. But here we're going to talk about the business heart of art. You know, you could be a successfully creative artist, but not be able to get your work out there. So that's what we're going to talk about. Now, how are we going to do that? How am I going to share with you about the business? I'm going to do that through interviews. I do a lot of interviews with highly successful artists from all over the world. I've spoken recently with Betty Franks Krauss from California. She has almost 100,000 followers on Instagram. She creates beautiful work. She does a lot of workshops. She travels the country doing workshops. And she also has a YouTube channel called Abstractly Yours with Betty. I've also been speaking with Claire Desjardins from Canada. Now, Claire is also an abstract art and artist and she has collaborated with companies like Microsoft, Urban Outfitters and Anthropology, and created amazing merchandise with her art. It's just phenomenal. She even has chairs and lounges with her merchandise on it. Like, <laughs> just mind blowing. And she's also last year created her own um, apparel, gorgeous dresses. If you like Desi Girl, you will love her work. It's just beautiful art, art to wear, <laughs> wearable art, I suppose. Also, I'll be speaking with Janet Skates, Australian artist Annika Winchop, who's been on the block and um, Grand Designs, lots of artists who's done really well. And they've done the hard work. They've been there. They've done the journey. They're still doing the journey. They're still doing it. And they have so much gold to share with us that, you know, we need to learn and hear from them. How did they do it? How did Betty start a career? in her 50s and it's just taken off like that's phenomenal we need to hear from people like that and give us encouragement and help us to encourage us to do these things the other thing i'll be doing on the artist chat room is giving you tips tips on get getting going getting motivated getting doing it you know we often um talk about needing to get fit and lose weight and one of the best ways to do it is to go to a gym or have a personal trainer to have someone doing the journey with you saying hey Natasha you can do it come on just another kilometer to go <laughs> something like that I'm here to coach you along to cheer you from the sidelines and say hey you can do this and you can do this so today's tip I'm thinking about imagine if Nike was a person what would Nike say to you in your art business what would they what would their top tip be for you today just do it get out there and do it get in your art studio if you don't have an art studio get into your creative corner and draw 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 do it every day Get out there, get your pencils, your charcoal, whatever it is, and draw, draw from life. Draw a mug, draw your breakfast, draw your sink. Get If you're not a drawer but a painter, get out there and start painting every single day. Get in your studio, in your creative space and paint because I will guarantee to have a successful art business, you have to be a great artist. You have to be great at what you do and start developing who you are and you go oh Natasha I'm not sure what can I draw what I don't have much inspiration I don't know well look around you do a teacup <laughs> do do whatever it is you know bananas are making a big toilet paper is making a big so many paintings of toilet paper it's phenomenal I love it you know get out there and do it Learn from the old masters. Get your old uh, art books out, opening up. Look at what Van Gogh's doing. Look at how his colours work together, how he creates movement in his beautiful works. Get out uh, a 
Renoir, he creates drama in his paintings. How does he do that? Can you do that? What are the successful artists of today? What are they doing that you would like to do? Now get a section of their painting or drawing and work on it. Develop your skills. Be really good. Be number one at what you're doing. And you will, more, you will be very likely to be successful if you're good at what you're doing. Now, you're drawing every day. You're painting every day. Guess what that means? It means you have content to post every single day. Now, Instagram is amazing for visual artists. It is the perfect flat platform to get your work out there every day, or at least five out of seven days. Get it out there. You know, take a photo, take progress photos. You know, don't worry if it's not finished. You know, this teacup behind me, it's not finished. I'm not worried about that one. I'm not worried that you're seeing it at a stage and you go, oh, that's funny behind her. Yeah, it's a work in progress. It is funny now. You know, it takes time to build great artwork and to get it out there. But post your progress. You know, do a video or a montage of your work. You, know, you can get your camera out. You can put it on time lapse and get do your painting and then post it. Get out there. Half finished done work is fine. I have seen artists post blank canvases guys blank canvases and said watch this space so you can you can post anything and start building a community of artists and follow artists that you really like and that you admire and learn from them and get involved in that community start making connections with people because that is really another way making connections when i was recently speaking with uh, Olivia Alexander, who's an internationally awarded artist, she said one of the big things that set her career off right in those early days was building connections, building relationships with people, with other artists, with galleries, with curators, just getting out there and building your relationships. And there's no better time than today to do that with the um, Instagram, internet the way it is, Facebook, whatever art groups you want to be involved in, get out there and do it. Be part of it. Now, we are talk I'm talking to you live during this time of social isolation and you might think, well, it's really hard to get out there right now besides, let's say, Instagram. Well, actually, it's never been easier to participate in competitions than it is today. You don't have to be there. You don't have to package your work. You don't have to ship it. You can, in fact, go to any competition all over the world and enter. Now is the time. All you need is a really good digital copy of your uh, photograph of your artwork and you can get out there and go international right now during this time of social isolation. Start looking. What can you get into? What competitions are going? When is the deadline? Start putting it out there. There's no better time than now. Another way for you to get to use this time of social isolation is what is your dream? Is it your dream to have an exhibition in a major gallery? Well, start putting together a proposal for that gallery. Start putting together your portfolio. Just make a start. Get it going. You know, don't just dream about it. Do it. Because the only, I'll tell you right now, what will make your business not work is for you not to do it. If you don't want your business to work, then don't do it. But if you do it, guess what? There's a chance it's going to go really well. So to start putting your proposals together. If it's your dream to get have your own gallery, you know, write down your dream, draw your dream, paint your dream, start putting down the steps. What would it take for you to do that? What would it take for you to open your own gallery? Start putting it together, dream about it, write it down, put the steps out there and start making contacts with people. Just do it. 
just get yourself out there. This is the time, this is the hour. Nike would say, just do it and go for it. I believe you can do it. No one will know how amazing you are if you don't get yourself out there and if you don't do it. This is the artist chat room. The artist chat room is a place where we're gonna talk about the business side of art. If you wanna hear some of my interviews that I've gone live, go to my Instagram page, follow me on Instagram, then you won't miss out on any future lives. I've been going three times a week. This is Australian Eastern Standard Time. I've been going Monday mornings, Wednesday mornings, Friday mornings. Look me up, find me on Instagram, follow me and you will not miss any send me a dm send me a message and we can have a little chat about what you'd like to hear about that would be wonderful also i'm going to start uploading some of my content here on youtube so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any of it and i hope you have a great day stay creative and just do it get out there i believe that you can and you will